Welcome to Go Okanagan. I'm Doug Brown. And I'm Anna Jackson. And today we are down here at the Colonial Museum looking at some of the fantastic displays that they have. But more than that, there is a new exhibition that's on. It's called Kelowna Collects, where local collectors have been invited to share their treasures with the general public. Curiouser and curiouser. We have a cabinet of curiosity here. I'm joined by Christina Neal from Kelowna Museum. Now this this is an interesting collection, but this is just part of the big exhibition that you've got on right now. Correct. Currently we have on the exhibition Kelowna Collects here at the Okanagan Heritage Museum where we are showcasing a timeline of collections in a European sort of model. So what have we got here? I said it was a cabinet of curiosity. What does this represent? This is a 16th century representation. People would have collections in their home. We're not necessarily focusing on collections in museums. We're focusing on what people collect, what right. people find interesting. And in the 16th century, it was very common to have the unique and rare pieces. Right. Um, so we represented that here from some of the pieces that are stored in the Kelowna collection. These are, you, you, these are what you have uh, in your vaults. This is what we have in our vaults, absolutely. Wow, you got so everything. We there's do like have a little bit. Little like puffer fish lamps and, and uh, caiman and uh, I'm going to cheat, a hoopoe, hoopoe bird? Oh, that's, that's very good. Good cheating. I didn't know that's what it was called. It says so right there. Oh. Well, yes, there's some very curious items over here, including a monkey skull and some interesting oddities of birds in unique little positions. Cool. Well, there's a lot more really cool stuff that we're going to check out coming up on the show. So what's very exciting now is we get to actually meet one of the collectors who has this lovely display of dolls. Meet. Christina Neal. Oh, <laughs> I was very excited to be able to share my collection here during Kelowna Flex, living in the Okanagan. Um, I previously have been collecting dolls for 25 years and they've actually been sitting in a box. I lived in the forest and traveled around the world. So it's really nice and feel very special to be able to share them with the community and have them out on display. But why, why dolls? Where is it something that you were, because you don't seem like a girly girl for me. <laughs> well, actually it started, I am a performer and when I used to do different performances, I would get a porcelain doll or a doll to go along with what I had performed. So, so we have Alice in Wonderland okay. from my, my days as a figure skater. And we have Christina, actually aptly named after me, showing off one of her lovely shoes. Okay, well, do they ever blink at you? Does that kind of Just scare you a little Alice. bit? Alice. <laughs> Alice blinks. Oh, well. She goes down the rabbit hole. <laughs>